What's up guys, this is Christian. I'm a creative social strategist at Reed Art Department, and I'm also the founder of Middle Child, and this is Ultra Rare Pairs. Yeah, I mean, I've been collecting sneakers since the youth. I was looking through the East Bay Magazine as a kid, kind of scrolling through the catalog. This is pre-internet days, so the only photo sources you had of shoes were basically magazines that came through your mail. And I remember seeing the Scottie Pippen too. And basically I begged my mom for these shoes for, for like weeks. So she finally took me to the store. She thought they're ugly. And basically I picked them out. And then from there, I was kind of just hooked. I've, I've always been on shoes throughout high school and kind of looked through the SB era, especially when the Pigeon Dunk dropped in 2005, I believe. And my middle school crave kind of went crazy for the shoes. But throughout the last couple of years, I've been more focusing on the actual design of shoe rather than the actual hype of shoes. I think uh, throughout the last couple of years, I kind of consider myself a semi-retired shoe head. Um, and you just you get kind of burnt out throughout the shoe game. And basically, when you kind of get older, you start realizing that the resale game has kind of shifted what shoe culture has been. Um, back when I was growing up, I just liked how shoes looked. I didn't have to worry about the price tag. I didn't have to worry about the hype behind shoes. Getting shoes, accessibility of shoes was a lot more easier back then. And when it got to the point where you started getting jumped for school, like jumped at school for pairs of shoes, that's when you realize the, 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 the dynamic of shoes have kind of changed. I mean, as a graphic designer, you start to realize the importance of the actual design of a shoe compared to the actual hype of a shoe. So when you see things like the resale market and you see the comments on Instagram and social media talking about shoes and how do you want these shoes and the resale, as soon as I get these, I'm gonna flip these, you start to lose low desire of the actual hype of the shoe because of the fact that they're kind of bypassing the design of the shoe itself. So a lot of the shoes I collect aren't so much more the hype or so much more with the price tag, it's so much more the functionality and how you can kind of present the shoe in a design aspect. So I call myself a retired shoe head because as much as I love the aesthetic and I love collecting shoes, I don't care so much about the hype and the new shoes, I don't have to have it. I can just be cool looking from afar. <laughs>